Oh, Come out of there. Come out of there, you're under arrest. No, I'm not. Come out of there. I just, oh, you hit my face. Suspicious behavior rarely goes unnoticed, especially when it's tied to something illegal. But what happens when police dig deeper and uncover the hidden truths? Sir, I give up, Come sir. out, come out. I give up. Let go of my dog. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Let go oh. oh, sir, I give up. Oh, get off. Oh. 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 oh, sir, I give up. Get him, please. Here are some intriguing cases when police knew she was hiding secrets. On May 15th, 2023, Ohio police responded to a call about Samantha, who had parked her car illegally and blocked a fire hydrant. Observing Samantha's slurred speech and slow responses, the officer suspected she was intoxicated and decided to place her in his cruiser. Hello, ma'am. How are you? What's yeah, going on today? Uh, I was just sitting here. Uh, hey, don't be reaching around in the car. Do me a favor, just step out of the car altogether. What's going on with you today? Uh, you got anything in your pockets? Anything to stick me, punk me, or cut me? No. I'm getting in there. I'm going to put your phone on top of the door. I'm going to walk back to you. Don't, don't keep your pants on. Stay with me. Friend, uh, Tyler. Um? He was, he had, uh, who's he? He had a glass over there. Right there on my phone. Who's Tyler? Who's Tyler? Travis, I mean. Still right over there. Travis, who's Travis? Yeah. That's what oh, I was Is told. that his car? No, I mean, like, it was. Hold on, let's see. How much have you had to drink today? Nothing. Okay, so be honest with me, because I can't do anything for you if you're going to lie. There's an open container on the floor of the car, and you're Where? firing it in the passenger seat of the car. It's empty. Floor, it's, right. It's been empty, actually. Okay. <laughs> so, I just got called about you getting into an incident with somebody on the road. Ooh. You're parked at a 45 degree angle to the curb, you're slurring your speech, and you're having difficulty walking. So, you can be honest with me, or you can not talk. That's fine. But don't lie to me, okay? Alright? Okay. I'll be right back. Whose car is this? Mine. It's yours? Yes. Okay. He used to be my mama's. He died. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, yeah, it's mine. I didn't mean to. I just can't let him get to it. Hey, um, please, this is really right there. That's where I was trying to go. Why didn't you make it there? I wanted to pull over because I couldn't make it. She was, I was about to call her. Why couldn't you make it? I wasn't able to. I was uh, incapacitated. Do what? I can't hear you. Incapacitated. Why were you incapacitated? The officer then searched Samantha's bag, discovered some pills, and immediately questioned her about them. Can you ask your Melanie Stubel I to take my car? I don't want to go. Hey ma'am, what are these? So it's all muscle relaxers? Okay. Um, Are they yours? Do you have a prescription for them? Not yet. Not yet? So they're not yours? Okay. Please don't tell my kids. Don't take me. Please don't take me. You show me out of it. I just got out of the hospital for hours. What were you in the hospital for? <laughs> Back in alcohol. What? I'm back in alcohol. You're back in alcohol? That's why you were in the hospital? How long ago did you get out of the hospital? I'm sorry, I'm drinking. I just can't put the light on there and it hurts. Okay. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, please. Hi, Miss Stubbley. Hey, that's 
medical line of care. That's all they give you if you go to the hospital. I swear to God. Hey, do me a favor. Keep your hands on your pants for me, okay? <laughs> all right, Samantha, I'm going to ask you for a blood sample. Are you willing to do that for me? My sister got my cord. All right, so I can't negotiate with you. It's a yes or no. I don't want to no. negotiate. Huh? Can you call her? She's my second kid. So, so I just... You have to call my next kid. I know you do. Samantha. Yeah, I know you have to call them. All right. Let, let's, Unfortunately. Let's start over. All I need is a yes or a no right now for the blood sample, okay? Either way, you're taking me to jail. Can you just call my sister? We, we can make I'll phone calls. I'll take you. I don't care. Okay. Whatever. Okay. All right. What's that, ma'am? My mama's car. She's dead. Please don't tell him it. Please. Okay. Well, it's registered to you, right? Yeah. Okay, so then you can go pick it up. Mama. But I can't, I can't leave it here sitting out in front of the street in front of a fire hydrant like that. Next, the officers inspected Samantha's vehicle. An almost empty bottle caught his attention. Upon opening it, he confirmed it was alcohol and placed her in cuffs. Huh? Oh, that's where it is. Not Sprite. Can I pee or something? Where am I? Can somebody call my sister, please? She's right there, please. She's right there. I want you. She's right. Please. Hey, Samantha, go ahead and turn that way for me. So put your hands on your back. No, please. Stop it, sister, please. Put your hands, like your palms together. Stop. No. Just stop no, moving I'm, around. No, I'm not. I'm sorry. I just. I'm no, you're fine. That's like you keep saying "ow" because you keep moving. Yeah, around I know because I have to pee. I'm so sorry. I'm in a hospital. Hey, you don't have. Years. You don't have anything concealed in your bra, your underwear, anything like that, right? No drugs, nothing like that. Nope. Is that a no? Yes, or are you not sure? I have to pee. I, okay, I heard you. All right, I just want to make sure you don't. Well, please. Huh? Like pockets on it? No. It's like a swimsuit, I think. Oh. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I think it's nothing in it. I promise. She's changed all right here. No, just in the, the pants. Pants. But that, it's a swimsuit. Oh, sorry, I guess that. My man. Just a little bit. Hello. What are you doing? I'm it. You're not helping. Oh. Most of it. Do you have anything else over here? I found something else. Oh, sorry. There's yeah. nothing else here? Yes, go, go for it. Probably. Well, it's just more. Why do you have chains all inside your underwear? I'm trying to get. I'm looking for it. It's like I'm not trying to scoot nothing in. I promise you, it's just chains. I can't afford it. Please. Do you have anything else other than change in here? I know, it's falling down again. Just stop easy, moving, stop easy. moving, stop moving, oh, okay? Okay. okay? Sam, stand up, please. You're not helping her. I'm holding you up, and you keep leaning back into me. Well, I don't because she needs the, the boobs. I'm no, sorry. You're good. I'm okay, down. that's all I was trying to do, honey. You can put it back there. Yeah, Lean around on the other side of the court. I have no clue. Have a seat. Uh, hey Josh? Yep. Some of that came out of her underwear. You might. Oh! Are they taking it? Oh, 
Huh? Please. It's gonna go to Sandy. No, I ain't got plans. Hey. I plans to be ruining my life for fucking 18 years. F you. <sighs> not you, not you, not you, not you guys. How much have you had to drink? I drank uh, less than a pint. What? I think it's three or four or so. This? Yeah, but that was pulled it or poured it into a. Uh, uh, uh. So the Sprite bottle? So you poured the vodka out of the vodka bottle and into the Sprite bottle? How full was the Sprite bottle when you started drinking out of it? Uh, that was that uh, last part. Like, to here? Last part. To here? Last Down there? Yeah. So that was when you started drinking or is that when you poured it into this bottle? So I poured it into the bottle. How full was the vodka bottle when you started drinking? Full. Huh? Full. Full, so brand new. Samantha was charged with OVI. Get ready to watch the hide and seek game between this woman and law enforcement, making the situation more exciting. Get on your face! Get on your face! Hold on, hold on, hold on. What's wrong? On March 13th, 2021, police were dispatched to arrest Misty, who had several outstanding warrants in Ohio. The officer arrived at the residence and informed Misty about her warrants. However, she was acting suspiciously, so the officer followed, but still made a fool out of them. Yeah. Oh, where, are you, where are your granddaughters at? She's upstairs. Okay. Are you here by yourself? Yeah. Where's, 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 uh, where's James at? He's, he, went, he went to go get a car. Send me a call. Please, for uh, just a uh, suspicious person. So I'm going to jail. What? I'm going to jail. Well, you, well, you have four warrants. Okay. So, do we have anybody that can, that can, that can, that can take care of your kids? I'll do for a while. Huh? Do you have anybody that can that come take care of your kids? I've got, I've got, do what? I've got, I've got, I've got, I don't know. You got, you got four active warrants. I'm not leaving. I'm not saying I, you're leaving. But I'm just going upstairs. Just well, well, I gotta follow you so you don't get any, so you don't get any weapons. Does that makes. I sense? don't have any weapons. I'm not I saying you do. Man. I'm not saying you do. All right. But I just need to go upstairs for one second just okay. to change well, I, my clothes. I need to follow you upstairs. I'm not going to go in the room while you change clothes. I gotta okay, follow you for, go for safety. Yes. Okay. I'm going in my bedroom and then I'll be out. She's in the alley behind 225. Purple hoodie, pajama, pajama pants.
I don't know where she went. I think she went back inside. I think she went back inside. Misty, come back down here. Where she find out was upstairs. Well, how'd she get back in? I think she went through the back door right there. I don't, I don't know for sure though. That bolt's locked. That bolt. Maybe she didn't come back in yeah, then. Unable to find Misty outside, the cops went into the house and unexpectedly found her hiding. Despite this, she was faking seizures when they attempted to detain her. Police! Come down here now! Police, come down here now. We're coming up. Ready. Police Hiding this little closet here. Come on, Misty. She ain't have no. S she got four or five active warrants. What's your name? Stop it! What's your name? Ashley what? Why'd you let her go out the window when you knew she had an active warrant? That's what we have. She said. Ashley got another one from out the window. She won't have another charge now. Right now? Misty? I got bit by a dog. Around the knee. Yeah. Barely, but it got me. Okay. The one in here. <laughs> it's really Trouble. Do with him because he will. Well, even, well, actually, when you find somewhere to put that dog, because if I get bit again, we're going to have a lot of trouble. I can put him down. Come here. It's like a bathroom. Come with me. It's a bathroom. Come on. Okay. Even with her pretense, Misty informed the cops about her headache, and the cops called medical personnel for a checkup. You don't need to go to the hospital. You're faking it. They're coming. They're on the way. And, and my name's Natalie. Your name's Misty. You're not Natalie. I know who you are. No, it's not. No, it's not. Then why'd you run then? 
Did you scare me? Because I scared you. Outstanding. Look it up. It's yeah, you are. Can you set up for us? I can't. Why? Because I can't. I don't know. Like, my head is hurting. I can't hardly see anything. Where's your head hurt? He's in the like, rear behind the restaurant there. He's in a flag, you know. Did your head hit something? Yeah, and, and I also had a head cut. Okay. Where'd your head hit? Um, right here and right back there. <laughs> We told you to come out of the closet and you wouldn't do it. We gave you an order twice to come out of there and you wouldn't. I was scared. My name is really Madly Bandit. You're scared because you have warrants. That's why you're scared. I'm Madly Bandit. No, you're not. That's him. Misty. Look it up and see. You'll see me. I don't need to look it up, ma'am. I know who you are. I'm not Misty. You're Misty. I'm not. Then why did you well, answer me this? Why'd you tell me if I come down, am I gonna get arrested when I saw you out the window? Because I thought I had a driving under suspension. I think she's saying her head hit the. She's saying her head hit the corner of this chair. Can you get up? You can't get up. All right. There's a squad coming. I guess. Other the way. Yeah. Can you sit up for the squad? Yeah. You wanna go to the hospital? Yeah, we'll sit up and walk outside and meet the squad. Look, all, look at all this chore boy everywhere. You can't move. You're scared. Yeah. What are you scared of? My hands hurt all Sit up and see how you do. I'm dizzy. Hmm. Yeah. And she went out that window and dog, dog lashed over my knee and it wouldn't let go. <laughs> you got any skin burn? There's your mouth. A little black marks right there. Break the skin. And it, it, don't, it don't look like it broke the skin or anything. It's it's not an up right. It's not an up right there. Misty kept trying to deceive the police by using a different name. However, because of her reckless actions, they took her to jail after a hospital visit. Uh oh. The dog's right here. Back down there. That one's growling, so it might bite too. Hey, come grab this dog, man. Yeah, come on. Hey. Lady. See, she hit her head on the chair, too. Sure. I guess she did. Did she hit her head on the chair, too? Sure. I guess she did. Did she hit her head on the chair? Yeah, she, I think she did hit her head, yeah. Yeah. We do. Yeah, there's problems. It's gonna bite me. Yeah, see behind your eyes? Yes. Sit up here for a second. Yeah. Is she in trouble? Yeah. <laughs> That's the guy that lives here. Her name is Misty. 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 Natalie? What's your name? Natalie. Natalie. You see how many fingers I'm holding up? Alrighty. We're going to sit up here. Hey. Hold on, help me out, please. Oh, no, 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 please, 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 hold on for a minute. They said you were trying to run out the window. Yeah, because I was stupid. Well, we're going, we're going to go out to the truck. If you want to go out to the truck, you're going to walk out, okay? Can you help me? Yeah, I just tried. I can't. It's you're going to have to, you're going to have to walk out of here. But we're going to drag you out in a sheet. That's the options. It's it's so bad. Well, you're going to stand up and walk out. It's going to hurt worse to get drug out. Because you can't. There's nothing. We can't fit anything up here. So you're either going to get drug on a sheet or walk out. Can you help me, though? Yeah, I mean, me? we just said we'd help you. Yeah. Oh, God. Uh, it hurts so bad. Hold on. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts. Hold on. Can I just give me one second? I'm busy. Okay. Control boy and pipes and everything else. Stuff. That's not mine. It's Read it nicely. You want to sit up now? Get up? What hurts your head? Yeah, real bad. Anyways. What's your name again? Misty. Where's, where's your it's, head hurt? It's Natalie. 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 We're going to stand up now. Natalie, what's your last name? Look Stanley. it up. I've already looked it up. I know, hey, up. I know who you are. He knows her. Can you get up? Misty. What's her real name? It's Natalie. 
<laughs> Stand up here. Thank you. Come on, we're going out to the truck. We're going to help, we'll help you. This one, though? They forced, you know? I don't know. I, I, just, I, I saw them on the warrant oh, list yesterday. So I came here. This is the address where the car comes back to. That blue car. I got a car to take to. Yeah. Did you have to wrestle or anything, or she was following? No, no, she was hiding in this thing here, and she wouldn't come out, so we had to drag her out. Nice. And that's whenever your seizures started happening? Yeah. Oh, yeah? She didn't seem to be having too much trouble when she was sitting in there, so. <laughs> don't, get, don't get her involved in your shenanigans. That's what I'm doing. Write that down. Attack it on. Don't get her involved in your fing bullshit. And I, guess. I can't. So you guys are doing something for my dog bite here? Oh my god. You got bit by that dog? Yeah, the dog tried to bite me. No, that that little yapper dog bit me. As I was, I was, I was trying to grab you out the trying to grab you from out of the window. The pet was gonna get a piece of me though. Yeah. She's not even a bite. Well, she didn't like me, she didn't like us. She didn't like the fact that I tried to grab you out of that window when you tried to run from me. I'm sorry. Well, now, now you get another charge, so congratulations. Now you're not getting a summon, you're going to jail if you get treated. You ain't, you ain't getting a summon, that's for sure. I got bit by a dog, you definitely ain't getting a Misty was charged with resisting arrest, fleeing and eluding, and battery on an officer. Now see how this duo's secrets became a nightmare when the cops folded them one by one. So, I can't tell you the reason why he stopped you, because I have no idea what it is, I haven't talked to him yet. Apparently there, we found a whole bunch of bills and is he your girlfriend? On February 16th, 2022, the officers noticed Raymond and Dryana driving recklessly. After a long chase, the vehicle stopped when the police cornered them. The police quickly detained the suspects and smelled marijuana. When they asked about it, the suspects acted clueless, giving them a hard time. Stay in the car! Stay in the car! Hands out the window! Do not Turn around from the sound of my voice. Hands up in the air. Turn around. Hands up. Hands on top of your head. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Back up. Don't look at me. Look forward. Back up. Back up. Back up. Passenger, open your door. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Face away from my voice. Put your hands up. Face away from me, Swenson. I got it. Step backwards. Backwards. Hands all the way up. Step backwards for the sound of my voice. Keep walking. Keep walking. Hands all the way up, please. Back up. Back up. Anybody else in the car? Yeah. You ready? Yep. Yeah. Ready? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Clear. Lucky I don't get you for fleeing and looting. Yeah. I know you are because I have my size on, but you're lucky you're not. You're going to jail for it. Open the door. For what? What did I do? One, you're in jail for shooting that weed. Which is starting to sound me. This is a straw. Spit it out. That's a straw, man. Yeah. I pulled this out for no reason. No, I didn't. For what? Your headlights out. My headlights out? Yeah. What do you mean my headlights out? And you're driving like a jack. Through the, How? Through the whole I neighborhood. The stop signs and everything. No, what you do you didn't. Mean? No, you didn't. No, huh? you're under arrest. For what? That's crazy. Y'all don't even. What's the reason? Can you put him back in your car. Mm -hmm. I didn't get a chance to. I was so far behind the dude. Yeah. Sell it. What do you got in your kids? I don't know. You don't know? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna find out one way or another, so it's up to you. Okay, that's good. Okay. How hard is it to get out? It's not hard. Buy them cup, you can take it out? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, sorry, you're good. Bang! 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 Load up! 
I'm in the wrong car. Hold up. I gotta get. What are you doing? She's gonna That's not good. I know. Can you give me one more? All that, and then there's a big, it, there's yeah. a big bag of weed in the front seat. I haven't got there yet. Alright, let's sit down. Do you have an ID somewhere? Yeah. Where's that? In my purse. In your purse? Can I grab it? Yeah. It's the uh, brown Louis Vuitton purse. Brown Louis Vuitton purse. It's right there in the front. Alright. After several warnings and a tense situation, Joyana decided to show what she was hiding. However, it didn't end there, as they found more narcotics in the vehicle. Continue bite. All over what? Do whatever we gotta do to get whatever it is out. What's up? I think this is where it lives. I don't know what True wants to do with it. Oh. Anything else? That was it. Or did you check no, I, it? No, I, I patterned her. Alright. And I said, what is this? And she said, I don't know. And I said, we'll find out either way. And she said, it's pills. And I said, can you get it out? And she said, yeah. Hey, she said her ID's in the purse, I think. That purse right there? Yeah, she said brown Louis Vuitton. You, uh, you got this right here? Oh, shit. You got that? You saw what just came out of her pants, right? No, it came out of her pants. Hey. Uh, more Spencer. It took me a long time to catch up to you from Silver Sands. Okay. At Silver Sands? Yeah. Where were you at? I was at Silver Sands. You were turning down Baker. How did it take you a long time to catch Because you're driving like crazy. No, I wasn't driving yes, crazy, were. bro. You trying to put that on What's your name, brother? You got this right here? crazy. You're talking about driving crazy. That was crazy. Reckless driving. Bro, you ask me what you're under arrest for, I'm telling you what you're under arrest for, okay? And besides, we found a bunch of drugs inside the vehicle. And a bunch what? of money. Huh? What you find? Don't, I'm not gonna play like play games like what did you find? Cause you know what I found, okay? All this cash. I throw Wait. shows. I'm a promoter. What do you mean? What's that? I mean, throw shows. I'm a promoter. But what concerts. <laughs> concerts? Yeah. I don't know what that means. How much money do you have? All right. There's nothing else in this vehicle that was here before. Okay? I don't have anything. Get in the car. Can you put my stuff back in my pocket? No, it's going in the car. You going where? In that car. Where's the girl? She's in the back of another car. For what? She had a bunch of drugs on her. Huh? She had a bunch of drugs on her. What's she have? Bro, I don't know. I had to, look, I had to test it first. Of what? Huh? What did it look like? A bunch of pills. Huh? A bunch of pills. A bunch of pills? Yeah. What? Yeah, bro. How much weed is there? Oh, my tell you the reason why he stopped you because I have no idea what it is I haven't talked to him yet apparently there we found a whole bunch of bills and is it your girlfriend is that your girlfriend in there is that your girlfriend that you were with why did y'all pull me over I didn't pull you over so I don't why know you me over? I, I wasn't there buddy I couldn't tell you so, uh, let's make sure if you find anything with the mall um, I'm leaving it where it's all at right now I'm not moving anything, I'm gonna let you bag it and then remember it. The cops then read Raymond his rights. When asked about the items found, he chose to stay silent. But the consequences were unavoidable. Is this your girlfriend that's with you? What's going on? Is this your girlfriend that's Why with you? Why are you asking? I get to what you're asking. Okay, is this your girlfriend that's with you or not? 
That one was horrible. Okay, this female that's with you, whatever your relationship is, what uh, she was found know. with a whole big old bag of pills in her in her shirt. Do you know anything about that? What? Tell you what, I'll read you your Miranda first, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. Okay, so found a bunch of pills on her. Do you know anything about those pills? You read me my rights, there's nothing to talk about. What's up? You read me my rights, there's nothing to talk about. Okay, I mean, I'm still just asking you questions. If you'd like to request a lawyer, that's more than that's your right. Heroin. I think I'm out of that one. It should be a mixture. No, no, it's just the same. So, um, you got to take the. Yep. I'm sure Mom, she want to talk to you. Okay. Oh, I'm pretty good mom. What's her uh, mom's name? Kenyatta. Kenyatta? Yeah. She was the, she was with the boy, so I don't know if the boy tried giving it to her to hide, to conceal it, but we're going to work on that. Because if you know something about those pills, and you don't say nothing, then your girlfriend or whoever that is is potentially going up for all those pills for distribution. You understand that, right? You're going to... If, if they're yours, then you'd be sending her up river for something that was yours. I'm just trying to clear it up. I want to know why y'all pulled me over. Bro, I wasn't there. I couldn't tell you. I'm just talking I to wasn't you. even pulled over. Y'all pulled behind me while I was parked. Well, that's legal. We can do that. You cut the lights on for what? I don't know. I wasn't there. How is that legal? That's I, illegal. I don't know. I don't know the reason for the stop. You stop people in their driveway? All the time. I wasn't stopped. I was inside my. I was inside the driveway. Then y'all yeah, pulled up. What happens? Happens a lot, man. I'm not arguing the reason of the stop again. I'm just trying to figure out where those pills came from. That's all, man. Again, do you know anything about those pills or not? If not, that's fine, bro. You're more than welcome to tell me now. I'm just trying to figure out what's going on. That's you keep all. asking me the same question. I'll tell you, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, that's all. That's all I know. This from, Thanks, buddy. But this from Uh No, man, right now, it's uh, we're going to do some more investigating on the vehicle. Because, like I said, there was a bunch of money. Uh, not really concerned about the ones, but there was a bunch of money inside, like, the glove box and on the, the male half. She admitted that uh, he gave the pills to her, and she threw them in her shirt. You say in her shirt? Yeah, she said she threw them in her shirt, but she was sleeping. She What's in her pants? Well, it's a whole thing. It's a whole thing. The box. So she threw, is that what she's talking about? Yeah. She, she moved and she, she put them in the so she put them in her body suit. Whatever, whatever that is. All right. I'm not a, a style on this. So, he said that. Uh, I'm going to sit down. You got COVID? You got anything else I need to get you, Joe? As long as the fluid is broken, the one that has the fluid in there, is there fluid at the bottom? Fluid at the bottom? Yeah. I've taken that Oh. Oh, never mind. Hey. What do I have to do? I'm going to go ahead and search you again. All right. 
Turn around. Hands on your head. Raymond was charged with possession of illegal substances and drug paraphernalia and driving with a suspended license. Dryana was charged with criminal traffic offenses and possession of marijuana. Getting bitten by a police dog is one of the last things you'd want to experience, but our next suspect got a first-hand taste of it. Oh! I don't got no fucking. What the f do to you? Get up. What the f do to you? What the f do to you? This body cam footage, recorded in Harris County, Texas on March 5th, 2024, shows officers responding to a stolen vehicle report. The man who was driving with his girlfriend's father attempted to evade the police by fleeing and hiding in a small storeroom. However, his concealment was short-lived once the police arrived with a canine unit. Check out how the whole thing went down. The passenger pretended to comply, but his next move led the officer to detain him. Man, he's running. On the ground. Get on the ground. What's going on, bro? What's happening? Got the passenger detained. What's happening? Hispanic male, black shirt, red shorts ran. Just uh, just the rest of my direction to the bayou. What's going on? Hey, what's going on? That's clear. On what happened? Why'd you run? I told you hit the floor. No, I'm broke. Put me on this car. What's your homeboy's name? Huh? What's your homeboy's name? My name is No, you don't. Yeah, it's David. Where does he live at? He? Yeah. He lives over here by um Howie Six and um what's going on? By Ron Paul Marker. Four three three, we got air support. Are you right here around the corner? Why'd you get up whenever I told you hit the floor? Huh? You started jogging, but you started oh, you're too slow. I don't know what's going on. Uh, around the contract. I don't know. Get up. I don't know what's going on. No, what's going on? Yeah, you do. No, I don't, bro. I swear. What, what's going on? Then why'd you run? What's happening? Like, I don't know what's going on. I don't know how to do I'm here at the party. Get inside! I'm trying to move. I stay right here in the corner. You can take me to my house. There's just some corner to see, bro. You can go to the store. That's it. What's happening? Come on, bro. What, what, what's, what's going on, bro? Can you take me to my house, bro? No. Well, why? Right. You shouldn't have got up and ran. No, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. Yeah, you ran, did. Bro. Did you walk over here? Watch my leash, watch my leash. Watch the dog. Meanwhile, the police with the dog moved in to capture the driver, who soon realized he had made a serious mistake by not cooperating. Sheriff's Office canine, if you're in that shed, you better come out, the dog's coming in. Watch out. Sheriff's Office canine, come out now, you're gonna get bit. Let him work it out. Here. Oh, 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 give up, I give up, sir, I give up. Come sir. out, come out. I give up. Let go of my dog. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Oh, oh, sir, I give up. Oh, get out of here. Oh, 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 sir, I give up. Get him, please, please. I'll let you get me. Just let Once the situation was under control, the law enforcers interviewed the suspects and proceeded by the book. You understand? 
No, no, I don't, I don't understand, bro. Okay. Like, what I'm gonna I'm 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 read it to you again. No, yeah, but I don't understand that. What, 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 like, why you, why you like me up? You have the right to remain tell silent. Me, wait, tell me the reason why you like me I up. Okay, if you want to talk, I yes. need to, I need to read you your rights. Oh, okay, 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 but well, you have the right to remain silent and not make any statement at all. Any statement you make may be used against you at your trial. You understand? Uh, uh, yeah, but I mean, okay. well, I don't, well, I don't any just... statement you make may be used as evidence against you in court. Do you understand? In court for what? What? Look, if you want to talk, I need no, to I'm read you. About these. I'm sorry. Any statement you make, baby, you you like to talk to me? Yes, sir. Like, okay. Uh, okay. What's going on? I'll why do? You, why, why did you get up and walk oh, away I after? Was... I, I told you hit the floor. Because bro, I was scared. I didn't even know what was going I, on. I, did bro, I tell you to move? Not that I know. No. Okay. I said stay on the floor. Is what yeah, I said, I, you and you still up. got up and left. I didn't left, bro. I just, I just, I just. You got up, up and ran that way. I, I was right here, I'm sorry. No, I mean, you. I, I detained you. I detained you right there. Bro, bro, sir, I promise. Why'd I you was, get up and walk away? I, I know no, you can get away from police. You know that, bro. I, I, I promise for the guy, bro. Why'd you get up and walk away that way? Then? I just walk away. I don't know what's going on, bro. Like he just everything. Did I say? So did I say you could leave? Huh? Did I say you can leave? Yeah, but leave? I'm, I'm right here, bro. I did not say you can walk away from the car. I told you. You just wait. I told I mean, you. You used to call for sir, so I don't, I don't know. But like, what's going on, sir? Like, I, I, I got my family here, bro. I was just, what's I was your just name? jumping on the trampoline with my daughter right now, bro. Hold on. I live right here around the corner. Man, you're probably not gonna go to jail. So stop crying. Okay. Sorry. Stop crying, okay? I'm you, gonna, you. I just, I'm gonna grab a wire, but my wife didn't know what's going on. I know, I know. You look, you're probably not gonna go to jail, mm -hmm. okay? I can't promise you anything. Mm -hmm. I, 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 I don't, I don't think so because you helped me out. Yeah, I'm doing okay? nothing, bro. I tell you, I'm being honest. Okay, so just, just, just hang tight, okay? Hey, partner, what's oh. your last name? Cloud of screws, bro. I didn't have to shh, do shh, it. Shh. What's your, last name? Pain, sir. What's your last name? Claudio Screws, please. Screws? Yes, sir. I got two last names. Claudio Screws. Carlos Cruz? Claudio C L A R O S. C L A R O S. Yes, sir. Cruz. Is that a hyphenated oh. last name? No, I got Cruz. Levis is my first name. So spell your first name. L E V I S. Sir, I'm, I'm in pain, sir. I can't. Well, I'm not a doctor. They're I'm, coming, I can't okay? I'm in pain with you. Why did y'all do this? To me. Why you Carlos, had to punch on me Cla too? Carlos Cruz? Because yes, I told sir. you to let go of my dog. You don't ever touch my dog. I'm so sorry. It's because he bit me and I couldn't. Well, you know what? That's it what was, he's supposed to do. It hurt so much. I couldn't. I'm Why so sorry. Why didn't you come out when I told you to? Because I was scared to be honest. Because you're stupid. Officer. I get it. I yes, understand. Sir, Everybody's stupid. stupid at one time in their life. I get it. What's your day about? Oh, sir, this hurts, bro. It's supposed to hurt. That's why the dog bites. It hurts. I did nothing to y'all, man. Well, actually, you were told to come out and you didn't. I had no reason to come so out. So, is that right? You spell your last name? C L A R O L? Yes, sir. Dash or hyphen Cruz? Clatter Screws. So is it a hyphenated name? last name, yes or no? No, it's Levis Clatter Screws. Hmm? I got two last names. I don't know what so that Clarice is. So Clatter Screws? Yes, sir. Oh. So the first name is Levis? Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Where all did you get bit? In the leg? In my arms. I'm so f***ing in my arms, too. I can't feel my left arm. Well, you know, that happens when you don't do sir, anything smart. I'm sorry about that. Well, I'm in, too. I, I, mean, oh. you, I gave you every opportunity. I said it on the oh. PA. I gave you announcements oh. at the this door. hurts. I gave you enough. He even kicked the door in and we said, come out. I didn't need to come out. I didn't Actually, you did need to come out. So that's just the way it works. Wrong. All right, well, hang tight. Where else he get you? You said what, in the left leg, left thigh? Left arm, sir. Left side. Look at this. Look at this. Well, this what he's supposed to do. My arm hurts. I can't. Okay, wh which one? With this left arm, please. I don't know how it looks. I can't. I can't feel it. Okay, on your left forearm? I can't feel it, sir. What about your right one? I don't know. I'm from in so much pain from my left arm and my left So leg. do you have anything else? No, sir, I don't know. I can't okay. check. Y'all just instantly right. started punching on Hang tight. EMS is coming. Just relax. They're going to help oh. you out. Our dog bit him. Yeah, but that's what I told you, bro. Like, I was on. I, I, I appreciate your honesty, I knew, man. I knew he was going to run over here. So I was like, no. Nah, and my daughter. Watch, walk, walk forward, walk forward. Stop. Right? Yeah. No, I appreciate your honesty, man. That's the main reason why you're not going to jail, okay? No, nah, thank you, guys. I'm always going to be honest, though. Like I said, my family is more than anything. And I appreciate you, you know, letting me go away. No, I'm a man of my word. I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, you know. You know, I got that chair right here. Cool. Let me, uh, okay. okay. I'll give you your hand. Yeah. Thank Good you. luck. Thank you. The driver was charged with unlawfully carrying a weapon, evading arrest, and unauthorized use of a vehicle. Next, see a surprising twist. This student got in trouble after her roommate revealed her secret. I'm just gonna advise you if you see problems, you probably already know, can't smoke weed. In the dorms, we know it's legal in Ohio, just prohibited on UC campus. Um, we also have pictures of the the, um, the fire devices, the 
smoke detectors being covered. On April 1st, 2024, officers were dispatched to the University of Cincinnati for Miss Ashley, who had been smoking marijuana in the campus dorm room. The officer gathered information about Ashley's activity and learned that she blocked the smoke detectors so she could smoke marijuana with her friends. Hello. Hmm? Hello. She did. Yeah. You have her information. Hmm? You have her information. I don't even know her first name. She's your roommate and she's just in here smoking weed and stuff. She smokes weed in here every day. I don't know. What's her name? I don't know her name. After the girl and I storm her thing, they just put her in my room. Because she got kicked in the wrong place for smoking. So they put her in here. Where's the RV on this floor? All the way down there. She doesn't do She doesn't what? She doesn't do all right, well, I'll let her know we're here. What room is it? Hmm? <laughs> know what room is it, all right? It was there, all right, on it. I don't... She stole my Avalon. My, she stole my Avalon Vivans from one spring break and had it in my dorm. And UCPD did nothing. Did you call us to make a report? Yes, I made a report. I made a report so I came back for entrance. My mom had to pay $500 of more months. What's her name? Okay, well, She's not even a student here. She has a blue lash and she doesn't go to class. I don't get to the point of having people in housing. Like, don't do shit. Okay. So we got Ashley. Can I take a picture of your UC ID? I'm just going to attach you to it. Yeah. And she had all of our. Hold on, I'm gonna put it down. She got over all of our fireplaces with plastic baggies and I took it down. Okay. She put it back up. And I sent her over this and I like, checked the rooms and she saw that and she still did not do shit about it. Okay. Can you send that photo to us? Yeah. If you could send that photo to my email, that would be great. What's your email? A N D E R. A -N -D -E when did she move into your, your dorm? She moved in um, the middle of February. Middle of February, okay. And then, like, every day it's been a reincurred problem for a small I had to get a hotel last week because I literally could not sleep in there. Like, my, I'm in this whole, like, place because my asthma's so bad. Mm -hmm. And so, like, I had to get mom had to pay for a hotel last week so I could sleep in my dorm. So I'd actually sleep for all of my tests last week. My mom should not pay for that because I've been paying for me to stay here. Yeah, exactly. My paying, yeah, I'm yeah. stupid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You guys can smell the weed down here. Yeah, yeah I can smell it. When I was going around the corner, as soon as we opened the door down there, we could smell it. Yeah, we could smell it. Yeah, it's like that every day. Okay. Do you, do you, the smoke detector is still covered in there? Is it all the smoke detectors in your room? Not in my room. It was just in here, but I took so, it out, but it's still covered in her room. So she's, she's covering up in the, the common areas, and she's covering mm -hmm. it up in her room? Okay. And she puts towels right here. Yeah, she's not smoking out of the hallway. We were obviously supporting her. It's not. Okay. Yeah. The on call RA is coming down. Okay. Is there a way? I mean, do you want her? They're gone, and all her friends gone out of my dorm. I paid too much to live here. Yeah, right. Okay. So is it, is is it just her smoking, and her friends are coming in with her? Yes. How many friends? It depends on the day. What's about tonight? I think there's one guy in there. Like one guy? None of them are used to speaking as well. She lives five minutes away. Like, her actual house is five minutes away. Hmm. This is her third time moving the dorms. Did you get her name? Yeah. All right. So are they all smoking together or is it just her? They're all smoking together. And they're not even you see. I'm sorry to come up with this. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I'm stuck with someone already was doing it. After a brief time, university authorities brought Ashley, and since it wasn't a serious crime, the cops advised her to stop and informed her of the potential consequences. Hi, Hello. Hopefully you can help us resolve this situation. Apparently it's been ongoing. She actually has people in there that aren't students right now with another uh, roommate. 
apparently they're, they're smoking marijuana and apparently she has just came moved in here from another place. She's right here. Huh? Oh, right. this is the one that would that you said was smoking marijuana? Okay. And there's people in there? I have my friend over here, but we're not smoking. Well, the whole floor smells like that. We can smell it coming down the corner. Like the whole the whole floor smells. We smelled it earlier. We couldn't pinpoint it. Um, so now it smells like a stronger. You just got home. Were they in there while you were at work? No. No, I didn't see it. So when did you get back from work? Like two hours ago, when I texted her, I needed a charger. So if we open that door, we can smell marijuana in there, and that's not for her. So who would be smoking? We wouldn't smoke it. had it on us, but we didn't smoke it. I don't even want to. We didn't smoke it. Well, that's, well I'm, that's what I'm asking for. He's not the lie to us. No, I mean, we didn't. We didn't it's, it's legal in the state of Ohio, but not on the campus grounds. No. We are on campus grounds, but that's what it's Right, oh, okay. yes. <laughs> um, so... What's your name? Sorry? Riley. Riley, is there someone in there right now? That's my car. Perfect. Okay, when did they get here? She got here. So they've been there for two hours. Mm -hmm. I just got home from, I was home. And you just got home? Yeah. All right, well, can we open the door? Whoever lives here, can we open the door and go in? Is that allowed? Yeah, I don't care. Okay, you just gotta make sure you're inviting us in. You can, I mean, this is your room. But yeah, it, I mean, it smells very strong like marijuana. Um, so, like, is there any, like, thing in the room? Okay. Well, then I guess this would just be a documentation. I will write an IR. You guys write your report. Is there anything else that you guys need to do? Can I get your, your record ID? Well, like we want to make sure this doesn't happen again. It's just like that action can't be taking place inside the residence halls. You have a picture of it? I was getting yeah, well, I was kinda of calling my mom, but I just leave she ain't answering the phone. Okay. You don't have your ID with you? Uh -uh. Okay. You know your social security number? Nah, I knew it, man. I'm just gonna advise you with UC policy. You probably already know. Can't smoke weed in the dorms. We know it's legal in Ohio, just prohibited on UC campus. Um, we also have pictures of the the, um, the fire devices, the smoke detectors being covered. That is a minor misdemeanor, so you can be charged with that. We're not gonna do any of that now. Just, if you're gonna smoke weed, take it off campus. It's also an inconvenience to your neighbors, so. though. Yeah, Alright. You guys have everything you need? Yeah, we've all the IDs, and then, um, are you going to leave the building? Yeah, I'm going to leave. Okay, then you can work out with them. I'm leaving. You're both leaving? Okay. okay. Right. Your personal RA will probably want to follow up with both of you. I've never seen him. Cool. Madeline is a great RA. I know she's probably tried to check in all the time, but I'm sure she'll try again. She hasn't. She's never set up for Okay. So why don't you step... Alright, do you need anything else from us further? Oh, we need your badge numbers and names for our report. If but you can you can type it in my phone chat or if that works with you. No charges were brought up against Ashley. Life is full of surprises. Like our next suspect, caught for one thing, but charged with another. Watch how it started. I'm not sure you're being placed under arrest for the shoplifting, you know it. Yeah, this is why I look. On June 4th, 2024, officers received a report that Tamat Martin was seen stuffing merchandise into a freezer bag and trying to leave without paying. Martin was in the store's security room, appearing visibly upset. Meanwhile, the police started the inquiry by gathering basic information. <laughs> Thank you.
He's just upset. So we've been trying to control himself. He's been out of control. And we had, he had gave us the idea that he ripped it off our hands. He's ripping paper off. No. You have your ID? So I, we I explained did, to him buddy. twice, you know, about the ID. He said he didn't have ID once we called. He took out an ID. You know, he's been un uncooperative. 126. Hey, you guys want to sign a complaint? I, mean, I was going to give him the chance of not signing the complaint, but. I'm, no. you know, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it away because it's just you know uh, it's like talking to a kid. So what time did he walk in here? Ah, uh, there's an apartment I'd say maybe that caught on to him, maybe about like 12.55, so I was going to watch him. So, I'd say if he walked in, maybe at 12.40. I'd say 12.40. I don't think he was here that long. And what aisle? Um, that's uh, what he took was um, men's t-shirts and dope shampoo, that's aisle three and four. And he started putting them in a bag? Yeah, and uh, one of those like frozen, you put the frozen. Aisle three and four? Yeah, that's what he, um, 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 After the store security trespassed Martin from the store, the cop handcuffed and searched him. But what they found on him changed the outcome. So, uh, one of those like frozen, you know, we put like meats in the frozen bags. Like, uh, you play one? Like to put the cold stuff in it, one of those bags. He put it in one of those. Like, like, yeah. like, the like, the yeah. uh, like a recyclable fruit? Yeah, one of those that you re refreshable bags. Yeah. That's where you put like the dough in there and then. And uh, the Haynes t shirt. He walked right past the register. Then he went right through one of the self checkouts and up and down. He didn't pay for anything. Not right? an attempt, man. Alright, too far. Yep. Alright, stand up, Ishmael. Well, I just have a meeting inside this way. Yeah, just sign that over there. Trespassing here. Over here. So. Do you want to take this off or something? You have a t-shirt on over there? Uh, yeah, but okay. I want to check the kids. It's hot out there. All right, so you're being placed on the rest for the shop with You know it. Yeah, this is why I look.
it wasn't aggressive until you guys just. Just. Um, no, I appreciate it. It's frustrating. It just started getting a little crazy yeah, in here. Just, yeah. Just upset. Right. Morning, love. Right, I'm going to send you the link from where you're on. Yeah. You grabbed everything? You have it on video. Yeah. Okay. Careful. That's wild, that's wild. Let's just from here. We're just gonna we're gonna search it real quick because I don't wanna take him out there and do it. You wanna bring my car to do it? No. There's it was two crowds, you know. Quickly. You have anything in your pocket? Yeah, ask him. If he has anything that's gonna, that's gonna step, poke me, stab me, nothing. No. Yeah. Okay, so. Wallet. So you don't have anything in there? Yes, I say yes. Oh, no, no. Nada más? No. Got it? Nada más, right? That's it? Well, yeah, straw, that's it. I'll grab it. Oh. You know my noodle? You know my noodle? Oh, you're making bread. Yeah. What do you say? Sorry, speak louder. What do you say? I can't hear. It's smart. It says something smart, but I couldn't really. Read, you know. I didn't say anything. I, I, I think I'm stupid. I don't know. You make it direct. I, I didn't say nothing. That's it? Yeah. All right, we'll see. We're going to touch you again when we bring up pack orders. Yeah. Thank you, man. Following the surprising findings, the officer transported Martian to the station for paperwork. Yep. Yes, 
是的。Take off the shoes. Check the dragon door. I just want to. No, no, no. Okay. I thought you wanted. So what do you want? It's just the shoes, the shoes. Give me a bag, son. See? Martin was charged with possession of drug paraphernalia. Ever wondered what happens when someone takes a chance with the police? Witness the intense moment when this man confronted them. Hey man, calm down, chill out. I'm coming down, dog. Chill out, hey, breathe. Chill, chill out. out. It's over now. I know it is, but ain't no been no trouble, dog. It's over now. Chill out, man. On May 8th, 2022, police stopped a vehicle for crossing a white line regarding Jerry in Texas. The driver appeared suspicious, stating the car belonged to a friend while showing signs of nervousness. I see your other one, man. He was reaching around. Okay. I just couldn't see what you was doing when I was walking up, man. I didn't know what you was oh, digging I for. Gave, I That's fine. Nothing. But you gotta you gotta understand my perspective, man, when I'm yeah, walking. I want I want to be I just seen you whip around. I was at the light, I just stopped saying I just seen you pull around and just stop me for no reason. So I'm gonna give you my license because I ain't got nothing going on. You see these white bars in the road, man? At the stop signs? You had to stop prior to the bro, bars. I, I, st I stopped to the bar. You was all the way across the track, bro. I ain't just interrupting you, but go ahead, pull my license up. I ain't no I ain't got nothing. Go ahead. You got a registration and offer yeah. the vehicle? Yeah. This your car? Yeah. Registered to you? Nope, it's my friend's car. It's your friend's car? Who's that? My friend, it's my friend's car. What's your friend's name? Huh? Tamika Phillips. Tamika. Tamika Phillips and Sally, and Sally Phillips. It's a simple question, man. I don't understand the hostility, yeah, man. I'm, no, I'm not having no hostility. I, just, I was at the stop sign, and you walked around, but you can't see I get routine. You can read up the what's it called? I mean... Well, like I'd like to see any unit area. Call me and just let me be one of the I said, no, I just seen, I like 
Well, I got, well I'm getting followed, but you can read it. Hey, Jack. Yeah, I have a reason why I know I got pulled over. Uh, he'll have to come back and explain it to you in just a second. Because uh, I'm not the one that pulled you over. Is this your car? No, it's not my car. No, it's not my car. Whose car is it? Oh, uh, it's my friend's car. Your friend's car? Yeah. Tamika. Like C396. How do you know Mr. Tamika? Uh, I grew up with him. I mean, with her or him? With her or my son. With her son? How old is Mr. Tamika? Uh, oh, she's okay. She's an older lady. Yeah. Okay. I see I pulled over too fast. Hey, they got me pulled. They say I ran a stop, a white line or something like that. I'm over here with my cousin. I was about to get him. The police they say I passed a white line, but I don't know what. I just drove a polo car and they say I passed a white line. Hmm? I ain't went that far yet. Uh, yeah, I mean. Put him on hold. What you got to do? What? I, I got them all. Got medical marijuana car. I got medical marijuana car. After detecting the smell of marijuana, the officer tried to detain the driver. The process didn't go smoothly, and additional illegal substances were discovered. Stupid dude. Stupid. Give me a hand! Where you going, man? Stupid. Man, I know it's in my car, man. Give a if it's your car or not. That's why I'm stuck, man. Why are you trying to run? Pull it up! Pull it up! I seen it while I was driving! Give me your f***ing hand! I'm not even gonna... I'm not even gonna... Uh, Y'all did what now? Cause you couldn't get away from me? No, it wasn't even that. Now we're in prison. Now they're in my car, man. You ain't working now. Rolling side. Stand up. It's another. It's another ball of aluminum foil. Yeah, it's by the tires. He dumped it by the tires. I ain't gonna. I got it. I got it. Hey man, calm down. Chill out. I'm coming down, dog. Chill out. Hey, breathe. Chill it's out. Over, it's over now. I know it is, but ain't no been no trouble, dog. It's over now. Chill out, man. Stop. Uh, I'm not going to do nothing, man. All right. Calm down. It's over now. Hey. Man, the only thing is my gun, man. That's the only thing. No, man. You good? No, 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 I'm talking about you physically. You good. I don't know how the f that happened. <laughs> when you do that, I don't know. Listen. There's ways to get around that. I told you. Without running. Y'all won't see me do what I see. I put on. I could have been with him. I didn't know what y'all about to And I, I respect you for that. But we just took it doing that. I didn't say it was your stuff. I got gloves on. Let me get them. Okay, I'm, yeah. I'm believing. I don't know if he is or not. You injured anywhere, man? You got a concealed weapons permit? I got a, I didn't get it. I did, I did my class. I never had this. Oh, now I'm registered. I'm ready to buy a gun. Where, where's it at? It's up under my seat. He was playing with it. Are you convicted felon? Don't. I know I'm going to tell me. I just worked in the prison, man. Nah. But trying to run don't help your, don't I, help your I case. I've never been in trouble, man. You could have said, hey, man, this I ain't my car. I got this. This is what this is. It's I everything said, man, other I, than trying to I run. I was talking to you and telling you that, man. They you weren't telling me that. I, I told you what I had in the car. I started talking to you. You're talking about weed. He asked you about the bag that you were trying I to hide. I showed and I had no, I was I, I took it. No, I seen it. When I, when I started going, I was like, what in the world? I started. That's why I didn't stop. I didn't pull over. I'm like, what in the world is in the car? Now I pulled over right here, man. I, I seen him following me first. I could have been jumped out, man. I didn't jump out. 
Once Jerry was cuffed, a woman arrived to check on the scene and recognize Jerry, but she was surprised to learn about his actions. Hey. I'm his son's mom. Uh huh. Speaking on him, he just borrowed that car because his car is at my house. You know who he borrowed it from? I, hey, I don't know because he, what he said, I took, he said that's not him. He said, man, he said. I took um, our car because our car is in, in our name. He had my son. He came and gave me a break for Mother's Day. My baby is in the car. He literally just dropped my son off the way. He borrowed a car. But you don't know from who? I don't know. And he dropped my baby back off the white screens and he came back over here and I was supposed to come back over here and get him. I just left my grandmother's house. We was have, having a gathering and I was going to come back and get him. Okay. Well, that, that explains the car, but we got some other issues going on besides the car. I'm sure that's not connected to him. And I, and I, I understand because I'm in law enforcement, so I've been a correctional. I, I'm not a correctional officer. I'm certified. But I work at Core Civic, been there for 14 years. Mm -hmm. And he was there all the way until November, but literally he all came right, so and got I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm going to put this on you. Yes, sir. Although he grown, and I shouldn't be giving his business out, but I understand as his baby mama, you want to defend him. But what we got from him, he had between his legs trying to conceal. Okay. When we pulled him out the car, he tried to run. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. So okay. The car, I appreciate the car thing, but yes, like I said, there's some other things going on that, uh, Okay, I understand, and and I, and if you need to ask um, Officer Wellington, I worked with him forever. Uh, Mr. Rogers, who's out there, I worked with him forever. My name is Good, and he's uh, we, we're not to questioning me. you. Not what I'm saying. I wouldn't be connected to just anybody. That's what I'm saying. That's my character. But he really did come and get our baby. His he probably just made a bad choice. Like he, he, bar he, he borrowed he, a car, and he did just drop our son off in White Springs, and I was leaving my grandmother's house at the house changing the baby and I was going to come to Lake City and get him and that's when he called he was like where are you so I'm um, just but yeah but if it's a whole bunch of other stuff going on I'm pretty I, I'm pretty sure that's not connected to him now what happened right here immediately I understand yeah, him trying part. to run is him all day long yes sir I understand that part but um it probably is scared and everything else, but like I said, he really did just drop our son off, and my mom and auntie, my whole family can vouch for that. Come on, let's go. Yeah. Come on. So, like, what, what's going on? Like, what yeah, are we uh, looking at or what? Well, they figuring that out right now. Um, yeah, because I, I know that car's not even registered to him. The car that's registered, registered to him is in my yard in White Springs for. That's not, that car's not registered to him at all. And he borrowed that car. He literally came and got my son. That's why the police is there. My son is trying to help us out. What happened? He, I know you're upset. I know. It's not him. It's my auntie. Who's your auntie? I'm trying to help him, but she's telling him don't say nothing, whatever, whatever. You split his up. They do this shooting in this car last night. That's not his car. Uh, yeah, his car is in my it. yard. Yeah, and like I said, he came and got our son, gave me a break for Mother's Day, and he literally just dropped our baby back off. Something was telling me to call him and come over here earlier, and I went home to change the baby, and we was getting ready to get in the car, and he called me, had borrowed the car. That's not his car. His car is in my yard. That's how did the shoot up. Well, he, no, that's not, no, no. Can you vouch where he was at last night? He was home last night because his mom, I talked to her whenever he was home because he was calling me to get the baby last night. Now that'll help him again for yeah. the happen, what happened yesterday with the car. But again, what? today incident, what he got going on today is all on him. Screen. Like something was telling me to call, come get him earlier. He borrowed that car. I'm going to call him. Yeah, I am. Can't borrow people's cars. You, you cannot. Know what the f cannot. Is going on. You cannot, you cannot, you cannot. And then cannot. he don't even want to like talk to them. They trying to hear from him, but he don't want to even he talk to them. He just, but he's scared for one. Scared? You see the, come on. I, I see what they, I'm going to see what they took. Mother's Day or something. See what they took out that car? Baby, I, I work in law enforcement. I work, I'm FDLE certified. I don't need to be associated with nothing up there about that car. But he did come get my son. My whole family come out for that. He came and got my son, gave me a break for Mother's Day. And he literally just dropped him off. And I was coming back to come get him. Something was telling me to come on. And I took my time at my grandma's house and voila. <sighs>
sky. All right, let me hang, hang out here. I'll find out what his charges is and what his bond will be, and I'll come back and okay, let you know. I'm Jerry was charged with multiple offenses, including possession of illegal substances intended to sell, carrying a concealed weapon, and resisting arrest. Watch this guy as he goes to extreme lengths to avoid the cops, leading to a tense and dramatic showdown. Sir, if you reach for that weapon, we will shoot you. I do not want to have to do that, okay? On August 14th, 2021, an officer observed a motorcycle driving recklessly in California who fled, and the police helicopter started chasing him. The police helicopter's camera captured the suspect fleeing the scene and going into a residence. I got the east on break for cover. Let me get you an address here in a second. Uh, 3100 East Orangeburg. Just pulled up into the driveway, dismounting the bike. Hang on, 3100 East Orangeburg, dismounting bike. And walked it to the, uh, the door, 3100 Orangeburg. Stay wide on it in case he pops out. Yeah. Hang on, we're walking to the door, 3100 Orangeburg. Let's go ahead and get a perimeter set up around this, uh, this house. Uh, it looks like we got contact at the front door, one at gunpoint, uh, facing the house. The cops entered cautiously and started clearing the house. However, in the last bedroom, when they confronted him, he fired his weapon and a shootout ensued. Modesto Police Department, if anyone else is inside, come to the door now and make yourself known. <laughs> Alright, a uh, small little closet that can be bypassed. Someone just you know, need to back check it and then it opens up uh, left into a large room. Front. Okay, we're going to flood that large room. I will be the last man. I'll deal with that closet. Can I that? Yep. Uh, Flooding into the large room and then uh, pick up your angles from the left Right. On your feet. They're up behind. Between spots. That open to a bedroom further right. That will sink to yes. the right. Left opens up to the backyard. Is there anybody left in here? There's an open door right. That door probably comes around to that, whatever. Yeah, I'm going to grab this. Hold on that for a second. Do you want me to breach it or hold, leave it closed? No, just sit there. Counter, one officer was injured, and the others took the suspect into custody. Someone glove up, glove up, glove up. Get Mikey out. Get Mikey out. Two of us will hold this guy. Do not walk those hands. Keep your hands up. Hey, here. Hey, we are actually. Hey, tell your radio. Turn it down. Do not move. Hey, hold him. Yep. 
Yes, move. You're clear to move. You want me to help him? Rivera, leave him for now. We're not. We're not going forward with him. They have enough. Just go with them, me and Ward will help. Hey, keep your hands up. Do you understand that? Sir, if you reach for that weapon, we will shoot you. I do not want to have to do that, okay? Hold on. Okay. Hey, stand by. Stand by. Hey. Just keep your hands hey. up. Hold on. Slow it down. Your hands on. Copy. Holster up. Yeah. We got you lethal cover. Copy. Okay. I got gloves. Where's that? Where's the door? Don't worry about the gun. Get him first. Okay. Yeah. Stand up. We don't have to, dude. Stand up. I know it's going to hurt. Stand up. I got it. I got it. I got it. Let's see. I got you. Put it on the bed. Okay. There's a slide on the bed somewhere right here, so make sure your hands are good. Okay. I got him. There we go. Hey, sit up straight from me, dude. Come on. Nice and easy. The man was charged with three counts of attempted murder along with several other charges. Next on the list, this suspect's flawed hiding strategy went sideways. Find out what happened when his scheme took a turn for the worse. Bro! Stop it. You yell at me? You're gonna be a bad day, bro. Stop it. Oh, bro. Why, why I, I've been nice to you, bro. Tell me, ah. tell me I haven't been nice to you. Bro. Ah, bro. I've been nice to you. On July 10th, 2023, the officers from Florida received a report involving a man who stole a shoe and had trespassed from the shop. The cop gave the man instructions and asked several questions, but he didn't follow them and behaved inappropriately. As a result, the officer detained him. All I need, Axel. All I need. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna watch out this morning. Huh? Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna watch out this morning. What's wrong? Can you let me five? This is last night. Should be home. Listen, they said you trespassed from that CVS and you went back over there. No, all I did was ask for some money from a, a, a hurry. Who asked? Me. You went over there to ask for that? Yes. That's okay. all. That's all. I just asked for some money from a hurry. Okay. You got any drugs on you, man? Nah, I ain't got nothing on me. Sure, sit down, sit down, sit down. Let me tell you to get up. Sit down. I ain't got nothing on you. Okay, sit down. Sit. sit. Down, oh, all right, look, sir. Sit down. Sit, 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 sit. Sit down. If you wouldn't mind taking off your shoes. Hang on, my shoes. Yep. You got any drugs in your socks? Oh, I ain't got no drugs on my socks. No? What do you think happened? You got drugs on you, bud. In your socks. Stop it. Don't even kick at it. Don't do nothing. Because if not, you're going to catch another charge for no reason. Okay? Just relax. It's not the end of the world. Cocaína, cocaína. I'm 
Just wait, just wait, he's got no Can you give me a little brown bag, please? What's up, man? He's got some cocaine. Cocaine. Where you steal the shoes from, bro? Where you steal the shoes from, bro? You don't get these shoes back, man. They stole them. Where you got these shoes from, bro? What is your question? Is that your backpack? Is that yours? Yeah, that's his. I saw him right next to him. Just grab it. I saw him with it. He was digging in it. Listen, I'm going to read your rights. See, I'm a little more competent this time than last time. You have the right to remain silent and answer any questions. Any statement you make must be freely and voluntarily given. You have the right to the presence and representation of a lawyer of choice before you make any statement during any questioning. If you cannot afford a lawyer, you're entitled to the presence and representation of a corner point lawyer before you make any statement during any questioning. If at any time during the interview do not wish to answer any questions, you are privileged to remain silent. I can make no threats or promises to induce you to make a statement. This must be of your own free will. Any statement can and will be used against your court of law. You understand what I read to you today? You understand your rights, off? Yes or no? Yeah. Yes? Okay. You have any pair of shoes? These belong to Marshall, so I'm gonna go over there. You have a receipt for them? No? This is a non reporter 65. Yeah, more stuff. Marshalls? Okay. You're gonna take it? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go and find out if it is, we take it. Okay. Uh, you want me to call the guy from Marshalls? After uncovering the stolen items and illegal substances, the police conducted a thorough search of the man before placing him in the cruiser. So tell him that you've you been going, you've been going. Let's go, buddy. You gonna put it in the car? Yeah. I was gonna put it in the car. Come on! No, no, we're gonna sit in the car. You got nothing else on you, right? 100%. Because if I find it, I'm gonna catch another felony. We out. Alright. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Don't be reaching. You can bring it around and stuff. Stop it, bro. Oh, oh, what brings you back to Palm Beach Gardens, man? I thought you got the hint last time. Hold on. Nothing else in this pocket. He's got another pocket right now. Bro, man. Huh? What happened, bro? What happened, bro? I thought last time you wouldn't be back to Palm Beach Gardens. I thought you would have got the hint. Let's go. Right here in my car, buddy. I'm going to double lock your cuffs and I'm going to get tied around Yeah. Hold up, man. Hold up. Stop moving around so I can make them looser, bro. Unless you want them like that. Off. Stop moving around, bro. Just relax, man. I'm gonna make them looser. You gotta stop doing drugs, bro. Man. Stop. I know. I know I'm making them tighter. Just keep moving around. That one was too loose. I made the other one looser, and I made that one tighter. bro. We're gonna give it to you now in the car. You don't get the shoes though. Uh, no Go to jail, bro. You'll be in jail for a couple of, at least two weeks. Come on. Yeah. Have a seat. Come on. Come on, step up. Step up on the step thing, bro. Come on, man. Step up, bro. What are you doing, bud? Mm. Sit down in the chair, bro. Now put the seatbelt on, man. No, no, no. Gotcha. I'm gonna make it loose for you, though. Watch out, bro. Bro! Stop it. You're yelling at me, you're gonna be a bad day, bro. Stop it. Bro, why, why? I've, I've been nice to you, bro. Don't ah. me, tell me I haven't been nice to you. Ah, I've been nice to you. Okay. Ah, 
up, bro. You, I thought you got the hint the last time, bro. Don't come around this garden. Can't do that here, bro. Regardless, <laughs> bro. Can't do that shit here, bro. No? I thought you got the hint, bro. I got the hint. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, throw it on there. Oh, this is all trash. Oh, it's all the way. Yeah. Listen, those socks are really nasty, bro. Do you mind if I just throw them away and I, they're gonna give you new ones down at the jail? Man, they don't give you s in that jail, bro. bro. They'll give you brand new ones. They don't give you s, bro. They'll give you new ones. Right out of the 14, hey, come on, bro. So you want those nasty ones? They're gonna go in your property anyways. They're not gonna go with you down at the jail anyways. No. Or you want me to throw them away? The socks? Yeah. You get those for free. That's what I told them. That's what I told them. You get it for free at the hospital. Throw them shits away. You get it for, they're gross, bro. Get new ones at the hospital. In the hospital? Yeah, those socks you're wearing, you get them for free at the hospital. So y'all are taking me to the hospital? No. Do you want the socks or no? Or do I just throw them away? I got your money and your glasses. Yes, no. Throw them away? Throw them away? Do I throw them away? Okay, Just relax. Yeah. We'll, we'll talk in a second. So the man was charged with petty theft and possession of narcotics. Don't miss out on thrilling stories about criminals. Subscribe to the channel for all the action.